Yes, we're back. We're back in Fernbus. Thought we'd give it another go at doing a proper route. This time we got the chance of going up to the next coach. And we'll see if we can go to two stops. So grab your guide to Germany and let's go. Hi there, Steve here, and welcome back to Fernbus. Yep, this time I thought we'd do a bit of a multi-drop route rather than just trying to go one place badly. I thought we'd try and go to two places badly. Um, so we'll click a new route. Um, I've only unlocked one more new town since uh, I uh, recorded something last, and that was down here. But I think in order to go to two places, I think what we'll do is we'll go, uh, we'll go from Heidelberg we started last time we'll go down here to Karl's ruler and then we'll come back up to Mannheim we can set our route number we'll go route 11 so 141 kilometers check-in time we'll leave it two minutes uh, we'll save that and we'll click on next and what we can do this time is actually choose a different coach because I've uh, got some more XP. I did one more route since I last uh, recorded something, so we can now go up to the uh, the twin wheel coach. So I haven't driven it yet, so we'll give that a go. Um, let's uh, let's get going then. So here we are then, back outside our bus. We've gained a couple of wheels, as you can see. So I'm guessing that means we've gained. Obviously, we know we gained some length. Uh, we've also gained some seats as well, which is great for revenue. So we'll get inside. Is it much longer inside? It doesn't seem to be that much longer. I'm guessing we've gained. Uh, I'm guessing we've gained some seats back here. So we'll set ourselves down. We'll close the door. We'll put ignition on. We'll start it up. Activate our destination display so people on the front know where they're going. We'll pop some lights on. Or some side lights anyway. We'll then go and set up all our onboard stuff. So Wi-Fi on, hostess on, toilet, reading lights, overhead lights, overhead display, air conditioning. And we'll set that to 21 degrees. And I think that means oh, we're ready to rock and roll. So I'll we'll pop it in gear. Release our parking brake and off we jolly well go. So if you're new to my videos, as always, welcome. There'll be a new firm bus video normally on the channel every Friday. Uh, as the quality of this game improves, which I do hope it does, um, it may be that the amount of videos and the frequency of those videos increases for the moment yep there are still a few bugs in the game there are still some issues with it so for the next couple of weeks at least apart from today we'll leave it as uh, firm bus friday so although yeah i do think this game has got potential i think it actually could become quite boring quite quickly uh, in OMSI that if you're a regular to my channel you know is the main focus um, it's all about sort of frequent stops picking up lots of passengers and stuff it's the bit in between the stops that um, is the sort of non-interesting bit that I find with this game I enjoy checking in the passengers uh, that bit's quite good although I do think it can get a little bit frustrating with ready um, and the driving dynamics are good. I like the switchability, the fact you got to turn everything on. I, yeah, I do like that. But I think that driving.
driving in between, having that distance to cover, um, is great. We'll see. I'm not going to dismiss the game just yet. I said we know it's just come out. Um, there are some issues with it. Uh, things may improve once we get track IR support. Uh, once we get some force feedback for steering wheels. Once we get some passenger interaction and we can put on some music possibly in the game. Um, the AI sorts itself out. You know, there's slight glitchiness with the graphics. Uh, once that stops, then yeah. So I'm not going to give up on it. Um, we'll come back to it every Friday just to see if it's improved. And then we'll give it uh, we'll give it a couple of months. Filling that Friday slot on the channel. Let's see where it takes us. Graphics wise, I do like it. I like the way you know the dash looks. I like the way it's uh, it's modelled. I like the sounds. So I do like the fact that you got that interaction with the passengers. Um, again, as I mentioned in the first video, um, just before the game was released, the developers poured it over to the Unreal Engine, um, and prior to that, the passengers would walk onto the bus themselves. So once you check that it means actually board the bus. Um, when the developers poured it over to the Unreal Engine, that code didn't port over, so they've had to pull that. Uh, it is something that will be coming back. Again, that will make things a little bit better. That's some of the things that um, make OMSI so good, is the fact that you get the passengers coming onto the bus. I do like that. I do wish that on the display here that's telling me my next stop, um, which is fine, how long I've got to go, but there's nowhere that's telling me instantly whether I'm on time or not, or how late I am, you know, how long have I got to get there. And we've got the speed limit down in that corner there, which is great. Um, but there's nothing again telling me that uh, what my speed actually is. I can see it down there just about on, on the dash. Obviously at the moment I'm doing more. But there's nothing telling me what my speed limit is. Again, one of those things I'm used to from playing ETS and ATS is on your, um, your sat nav you've actually got your current speed and the speed limit so you can just glance at that and know where you need to speed up or slow down so yeah a couple of things I'm hoping they will iron out in this when you're out on the on the highways it's fine but when you're in town the theme is you're just getting caught by traffic lights all the time and this thing doesn't accelerate 
quickly at all. Right, so there's my passengers over there, so I've got to go up and round this roundabout before I can pick them up. Yeah, some improvements to the AI is definitely needed. To drive, I'm not used to driving without track IR. Oh, the foot's flat to the floor now. So I've got to remember as well that I'm in a longer. <laughs> I'm in a longer coach. Okay. So here we are at our first pickup then. So, parking brake on, into neutral. Doors open. What we get? Open the luggage compartment. All the bags disappear. Go. Okay. Start checking some people in. Yeah, hang on, I need to get now, I'll log in first. Right, so you are Mafia Mole. Yep, you're on the list, sorry, up, get on. And Bernard, yep, you're on the list, get on. August Tildebrand, strange name. Uh, yep, you're on the list, get on. Leno, Petal, what do we call it? This go away. Okay, here are you, Estel Baumeister. Yeah, you're on the list, get on. Sebastian Schmidt. Yeah, you're on the list, get on. Nina Schreiner, yeah, you're on the list, you can get on. Francisco Pax, name is yet, you're on the list, you can get on. Luca Elsma. Luca Elsma, you're not on the list, go away. Ramon Bocart. Yep, you're on the list, you're on the bus. Luca Rice, yeah, you're okay, you can get on. I just drive the next bus. You drive the next bus, okay. So you're the bus driver, right? Yes. Ben Hins, Ben Hins can get on. And we'll find it, and he's uh, Alan. We'll find two more. Everybody else, good luck and thank you. Close that door. For myself, I suppose, always a plus. Okay, close that door. Okay, now look at me thingy. Uh, 557, 602. So, what I can now do is advance that to a minute before departure. Okay, and click start right. So everyone's on, so I've got 12 passengers on. So that's good. Right, so we've got a minute to go before we depart. So what I need to do is number five, click on the announcement. Hallo und herzlich willkommen bei Flixbus. Wir freuen uns, dass ihr an Bord seid und wir gemeinsam unser heutiges Reiseziel ansteuern. Bevor wir richtig in Fahrt kommen, hier ein paar Hinweise. Auch bei uns im Bus gilt die gesetzliche Anschnallpflicht. Bitte schnallt euch deshalb während der gesamten Fahrt an. 
In den Sitztaschen vor euch findet ihr unsere Bordkarte mit weiteren Sicherheitshinweisen und Infos zu unserem Snack- und Getränkeangebot. Eine Toilette befindet sich im hinteren Einstiegsbereich. Wer kostenlos surfen will, wählt sich einfach in unser WLAN-Netz ein. Unser Reisetipp fürs Internet? Schaut doch mal auf unserer Facebook-Page vorbei. Unser Team freut sich riesig über eure Likes und Nachrichten. Sollte euer Akku zu Neige gehen? Kein Problem. Viele unserer Sitze sind mit Steckdosen ausgestattet und entsprechend gekennzeichnet. So könnt ihr euer Smartphone die gesamte Fahrt über nutzen. Wenn ihr eure nächste Fahrt auch gleich mobil buchen wollt, holt euch einfach unsere App und profitiert von exklusiven Online-Angeboten. Auf flixbus.de stehen täglich brandaktuell alle Infos und Städteverbindungen für euch bereit. Natürlich wollen wir unseren Service ständig weiter verbessern. Für Feedback zu eurer Fahrt nutzt bitte den Fragebogen, den wir euch per E-Mail zuschicken. Wir danken für eure Aufmerksamkeit und wünschen eine entspannte Fahrt und viel Spaß an Bord bei Flixbus. Hello and welcome to Flixbus. We're glad to have you on board and that we can get you to your favorite destination today. Before we set off, we would like to share some information about the journey. The wearing of seat belts is compulsory on board the bus. Therefore, please keep your seat belt fastened throughout the entire journey. In the seat pocket in front of you, you will find our information card containing further safety instructions and details of our snacks and beverages. There is a restroom located in the rear boarding area. If you would like to browse the internet free of charge, simply log on to our onboard Wi-Fi network. If your battery runs out, no problem. Many of our seats are equipped with power outlets which are marked accordingly. If you would like to book your next journey while you're on the road, simply download our app onto your smartphone so you can take advantage of our many exclusive online discounts. For more information, simply visit flixbus.com or get in touch with us on Facebook. Of course, we're always striving to improve our service. Please use the questionnaire we send you by email to give us feedback about your journey. You can also use it to share your suggestions, ideas and requests. We are always ready to assist. And now, we can finally set off. Thank you for listening. We hope you have a relaxing journey and enjoy traveling with Flixbus. Yeah, well that was a lot of announcement, wasn't it? See, I do like that bit of the picking up the passengers. Um, can be a bit fiddly, but um, it does make it interesting. It's not just a case of you open the door and on they get. You've got to make sure they're sort of going to you. You actually sell them a ticket if need be. And the driving's okay. Uh, I haven't done any of the random events yet, like the, the police check. I haven't done enough of a long journey yet to need to um, fill up the fuel, but you have to do that as well. So yeah, I'm just... Initially, and I played it... Um, well, it's Saturday as I record this, and I played it sort of two days ago. Um, I thought, yeah, this has got a lot of potential. But now, I don't know. something I'll obviously come back to as I said uh, on a weekly basis but um, yeah I still like Omsi I 
speedo is just a little bit, I can just about make it out. Oh, red light. It's okay, it's all good, nothing was coming. See, now the next stop disappeared. It's now saying zero, which I drove this route earlier today. Uh, and it did the same thing. There's obviously a glitch with the map there. It went over a motorway bridge and it came back again. So there are some bugs. Let's see, I will give the game some time. I'm just not used to having all this distance between the stops. I know some with Omsi where there's stuff, you know, there are a bit distance, but there's more going on. It's a 100k speed limit. Seems to be too quick for a road like this as well. coach like this. Great to know how I'm doing on time. Because you've got no idea. Okay, yeah, I suppose I can bring up my computer thing, but the whole the game would pause. And that's you know the thing you bring up your computer and the sound goes off, so it's actually going to the pause menu. Well, I think there should be an option of bringing that computer up without actually sort of pausing the game. But I'm being very critical of it, I know. But there are a lot of things it does right, but some other things that it's not doing right. I don't think, anyway. earlier I was panicking thinking I'd actually missed my stop. I don't think there's enough initially sort of variety. It's you know you're picking up people, you're driving from one place to another place in the same coach all the time. There's no the only difference is the road you're driving on. Well, with Omsi you're getting different passengers come on. You can drive different buses. You can drive different routes in the same city. Um, this is pretty much just like driving, although be it on a bigger scale, it's like driving in one map in Omsi, um, albeit, you know, the different towns could be different routes, you go from one place to another place. You've got to set the route as well, I don't know if I like that. Um, it'd be nice if there was sort of predetermined routes that you could do, but yeah, to me at the moment, it's like driving an Omsi in the same bus all the time, on the same map all the time you just got to go to different destinations and you pick the destinations you go through. So I don't know, you tell me. Um, drop a comment below. Is it something that uh, you want to see me carry on with on the channel? Is it a game that 
you're going to contemplate buying. Are you an OMSI fan? And did you contemplate this? Initially, what I would say is wait a while. If you're thinking about buying it, you know, I will keep putting out the weekly videos. So perhaps wait if things do improve. It's always one of those things with uh, with new games that, yeah. You know, when ETS first came out, and certainly ATS first came out, it wasn't great at all. Uh, I never played OMSI, the original OMSI. But OMSI 2, yeah, there's still bugs in that. Not a lot has changed in the actual gameplay aspect of it. But there are still bugs in it. thoughts and the initial sort of hype for the game and was looking forward to the game yeah now I'm not so sure and I'm getting less frame rate out of this than I am well than I do get out of OMSI sometimes I'm currently sort of hovering around the sort of 30 frames. thing 655 656 that's uh, not bad actually I changed that so it's advanced it to a minute of departure yet yeah, 657 start ride 
Hallo und herzlich willkommen bei Flixbus. Wir freuen uns, dass ihr an Bord seid und wir gemeinsam unser heutiges Reiseziel ansteuern. Bevor wir richtig in Fahrt kommen, hier ein paar Hinweise. Auch bei uns im Bus gilt die gesetzliche Anschnallpflicht. Bitte schnallt euch deshalb während der gesamten Fahrt an. In den Sitztaschen vor euch findet ihr unsere Bordkarte mit weiteren Sicherheitshinweisen und Infos zu unserem Snack- und Getränkeangebot. Eine Toilette befindet sich im hinteren Einstiegsbereich. Wer kostenlos surfen will, wählt sich einfach in unser WLAN-Netz ein. Unser Reisetipp fürs Internet? Schaut doch mal auf unserer Facebook-Page vorbei. Unser Team freut sich riesig über eure Likes und Nachrichten. Sollte euer Akku zu Neige gehen? Kein Problem. Viele unserer Sitze sind mit Steckdosen ausgestattet und entsprechend gekennzeichnet. So könnt ihr euer Smartphone die gesamte Fahrt über nutzen. Wenn ihr eure nächste Fahrt auch gleich mobil buchen wollt, holt euch einfach unsere App und profitiert von exklusiven Online-Angeboten. Auf flixbus.de stehen täglich brandaktuell alle Infos und Städteverbindungen für euch bereit. Natürlich wollen wir unseren Service ständig weiter verbessern. Für Feedback zu eurer Fahrt nutzt bitte den Fragebogen, den wir euch per E-Mail zuschicken. Wir danken für eure Aufmerksamkeit und wünschen eine entspannte Fahrt und viel Spaß an Bord bei Flixbus. Hello and welcome to Flixbus. We're glad to have you on board and that we can get you to your favorite destination today. Before we set off, we would like to share some information about the journey. The wearing of seatbelts is compulsory on board the bus. Therefore, please keep your seatbelt fastened throughout the entire journey. In the seat pocket in front of you, you will find our information card containing further safety instructions and details of our snacks and beverages. There is a restroom located in the rear boarding area. If you would like to browse the internet free of charge, simply log on to our onboard Wi-Fi network. If your battery runs out, no problem. Many of our seats are equipped with power outlets which are marked accordingly. If you would like to book your next journey while you're on the road, simply download our app onto your smartphone so you can take advantage of our many exclusive online discounts. For more information, simply visit flixbus.com or get in touch with us on Facebook. Of course, we're always striving to improve our service. Please use the questionnaire we send you by email to give us feedback about your journey. You can also use it to share your suggestions, ideas and requests. We are always ready to assist. And now, we can finally set off. Thank you for listening. We hope you have a relaxing journey and enjoy traveling with Flixbus. So, if you're a bus driver for Flixbus, how long would it be before you got so fed up listening to that?
we'll see by coming back to this uh, once a week from now on on a Friday um, we'll uh, we'll see what improvements there are hopefully over the coming weeks things do continue to improve signs warning me that there's traffic lights coming up. earlier today and I was told I was driving too slowly. It was raining like this so I slowed down and they were complaining I was going too slow. Come on then. There goes that 
shows that there's a, an issue somewhere. and some of the routes you actually hear people talking that would be quite cool so we'll see um, we'll give it another few weeks although the one video is going to go out on the OMSI Friday following this I'm probably going to record the day after I record this one so not a lot's going to change for that one and then I'll record every weekend for the following Friday Did I not finish the journey? Was it supposed to be a three part? Oops. Um, okay, I'm going to just flick through these then. Uh, scheduled departure, not out of two. Air condition 97%, traffic rules. Hey, I did well on traffic rules and driving behavior. Oh, safety isn't broken once. I've gained a level. Now level three. I can now drive at night. Wow. So there we go then. Um, multi drop done. Why have we got two buses side by side? I think that just goes to show one of the glitches there are there. Um, that's not good really is it um so that's it until um, the next firm bus friday if you have been until then thanks very much for watching <laughs>